Hey boys and girls, um, I know I haven't posted a video in a long time uh, about the skunk, so I thought I would check in and let you all know what's been going on. Um, I've been pretty busy because I adopted a dog. That's Phoebe. Hi Phoebe. I got her from my local animal shelter and um, she was going to be put to sleep because she wouldn't walk on a leash. She was a cruelty case and had been abused and was very nervous. So I just couldn't let him put her to sleep. She's the sweetest dog and she loves animals and kids and everybody she meets. So she's doing very well and she is walking on a leash now. So that's good. Uh, as far as the skunk goes, um, I had picked him up and noticed a marble-sized lump on his underside, kind of near his um, armpit, and I took him into the vet and they said that it was cancer and that they thought that it was all confined to that one lump. So they did the surgery and they removed the lump and they removed a little around the lump. And they think they got everything. She said other than that, he is really healthy. He's lost three pounds, which puts him at 11 pounds, which is a little bit overweight for a skunk his size and his age. Um, He's always going to be a big skunk, but he is almost average weight. So he has lost a lot of weight since probably one of the last videos I posted of him. So he's got a big incision on his belly that's healing, and um, he's just getting better every day. He's five years old now. So um, domesticated skunks tend to live between six and ten years. So he's a middle-aged grumpy man, and... Uh, He's just still his skunky self. And uh, to give you a comparison, skunks in the wild tend to live one to two years. They get disease or get hit by cars or other predators get them. So domesticated skunks, they really got the life. So um, he's eating his dinner right now. Why don't we go and um, check on him? Let's go. I'm going to walk in. Here's Phoebe. See this skunk? Here's Hi. Emma. Hi, Hello. Emma. Hello. He's having his dinner. Hi. Oh, I'm sorry. I won't touch it. I'm not going to touch your dinner. Are you feeling better? Look at that messy face. He has lost weight. I'm sorry. I'll leave you alone. Oh, quit being a grumpy puss. Nobody wants your dinner. Okay, fine. He's grumpy, Phoebe. So that's the skunk. Um, sorry it wasn't longer, but he was eating and I didn't want to bother him and he's kind of grumpy. So once he's all healed up and he's not so sore, I'll take more videos of him. And um, it's really funny watching him interact with Phoebe, the new doggy, because he thinks he's in charge. Well, he is in charge of all the animals in the house. So, um, hopefully I'll have some more videos for you soon, and thank you for all of you subscribing and the new subscribers and, uh, everybody who just loves the skunk. So, I will talk to you all very soon. Bye.